Hi guys, welcome back. Lady T here. Today I'm going to do a video on tiny trees. I'm going to do the cedar tree, the hardwood tree, and a coconut tree. Uh, you can also do it with bamboo. I'm just going to use those three. So first of all, you have to plant your sapling. So this is a hardwood sapling. We'll plant one of those. And then I'll plant cedar sapling. And then to do your coconut ones, you have to put sand on grass. Otherwise it won't grow. I will do that quickly. Okay, so you need the sand path from Nook Miles. It costs 2000 to get that one. So you just need to put one square in the ground. And then get your shovel. And dig a hole in it. And then you can plant your coconut. Okay. So now all you have to do is you let them grow to your desired height. So the first one will be one day from now and we will speed forward to that. Okay, so this is one day after planting the saplings. If you want your trees this size, all you have to do is plant a fruit tree behind them. I'm going to do it with this one actually. I will do it with this one. So you just plant a fruit tree. Doesn't matter what fruit. And then that tree won't grow. These two will grow again. So we will go one more day into the future and see what they are then. Okay, so as you can see, this tree did not grow any further. This one and this one both grew one more day. Now I want the pine tree this size, so I'm going to take it and move it to where I wanted to put it. This one, yes I wanted to grow one more, so I'm not going to put a fruit tree behind it, but we will take this. I wanted to put it over in my forest. Okay, so as you can see, I have one little tree here. So I'm going to plant a fruit behind it so it doesn't grow any further. But I want to change this one. And I want it to be the next size up. So I will eat my fruit. dig up this tree and I will plant my medium young cedar in it and I think they look very cute like that so but I want this to go one more day so I'm not going to plant anything behind it and see what it looks like tomorrow. Okay, so today is day three. And as you can see, so the first tree still has not grown. I did plant two more of these because I want a couple of them around my island. And here is the palm tree. And I think it's absolutely adorable at that size. I'm going to put a fruit tree behind it. Now, when they are little, some of the trees, you can see the fruit tree behind it. But if they're put, that one's actually not too bad. You can barely see it, unless you're on the sides. Um, if you put it in an area that has other things, other flowers and items and stuff around it, it'll blend in. You won't even really notice it. The sapling 
for the hardwood. I think I would probably go one more higher because it's a little bit too tiny. Um, I do want to put more tiny trees, various spots around my island, so I think I will dig up the fruit and let this one grow. That wasn't the fruit. So I'll plant the tree back down and try again. So I'm going to let that grow one more day. I'm going to let these guys grow one more day. And I'm going to go see how the tree is in the forest. So there. I love the pine trees when they're smaller. These two are my favorite sizes. So in order for this not to grow any further, Plant a fruit behind it. There's fruit peach. And there you go. And that is how you have your mini trees. I think I might put another mini tree here when they grow one more day. I can move it now. And I had the one up top, which I also don't want to grow any bigger. So I will go up here and plant fruit behind it. Okay, there you go. I hope you enjoyed my video and got a little bit of tips on designing for little trees. Um, you can put them most places. Now I did try to put a tree here and it wouldn't go so they do still follow some of the parameters for the large size trees. Now I don't know if the little little ones would fit here. I did not try that. I will try it another time and I'll follow it up. But for now, um, enjoy the rest of your day and if you liked my video hit like and subscribe and uh, see you again soon. Bye!